and technology taking over the classroom. How creating apps is now part of the curriculum at seven Chicago area schools. Stick around, we'll be right back. That's how we do it bright and early here on Good Day Chicago. We get things yeah. started even before the sun comes up. And uh, now we're talking about a story here. The reality is we use them every day on our cell phones and tablets. And no matter what the question is, usually the answer is, there's an app for that. And now, as you found out, uh, they're actually changing the way we learn. Yeah, this year, seven Chicago area schools are going beyond the traditional math and science classes, moving lessons from the lab to the computer screen. Take a look. Like most high school freshmen, Kyle Shaheen loves his devices. My first iPod I ever had, it was like a first generation iPod. I've maxed out all the apps on the iPad and it was like 10, 20 pages. And like many 14 year olds, he spends hours every day on those apps. Classic Clans, the YouTube app. Now he gets to do that in a classroom. So let's run it right now. And this is what the app will look like. Elk Grove High School is one of seven Chicago area schools making mobile app development part of their curriculum. It's through the Mobile Makers for High Schools program. 500 students in Barrington and Arlington Heights are learning to build apps for Apple devices in the company's newest programming language. So what students are learning to do is how to both come up with the idea of how to develop an app. Dan Widener is the director of career and technical education. He says the program is among the first of its kind in the nation, putting Chicago area schools at the forefront of global technology. People create apps um, that they can take home, that they can share with their friends um, right here today walking out of this class. This is the interface, you know, this is what the users are going to see. In class today, students are learning to develop a tip calculator um, app. And let's say an average tip is 15%. The class is a hit, the response from students overwhelming. Yeah, exactly, bingo. Teacher Kristen Fisher says her students are so excited, so engaged, many are volunteering to come help other classes during their lunch hour and after school. They're enjoying the course so much that it's natural for them to be collaborative and want to help each other. And I haven't seen that in, say, in 10 years of teaching. What we're really looking at doing is providing our students with the relevant curriculum that goes directly into the uh, industry. It's a booming industry Kyle already knows he wants to go into. What do you want to be? Computer programmer for sure. He's not even done with this class and he's already excited for the next. Have you ever felt this way about a class? No, no, except Jim from like middle school. <laughs> that was the only exciting class. Recess perhaps? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, okay. Now, this is my favorite class now. So by the end of that year-long class, these students will have developed nine mobile apps. So really the next time, John, you say, there's an app for that. It may be Probably. thanks to Kyle or one of the kids sure. in that class. It's unbelievable what they're doing. It is mind-blowing. It's inspiring yeah. to think these kids these days, uh, the talent they have, the access they have to do things like right, this. Right, right. Congratulations Very to cool. all those guys. Great story, by the way. Thank you.